heading off to Archfield Drift Park tonight for beginners drift night practice and coaching. I don't know with the whole, it's, it looks like it's going to rain tonight, so I don't know if we'll get washed out or if people will bail. It should be great. Alright, let's get some stuff out. We've just got to Archerfield. That's built by Kyle in the blue and maroon BMW. This is his first run since I've been here. He's telling me that the car keeps overheating, so he's not getting any more than about two laps out of the car. Uh, we have a van, <laughs> uh, some 31s, some Zeds, some ADM. <laughs> uh, I hope you guys can hear the word he's playing in there without me getting flagged for copyright. That's great. <laughs> He's uh, playing Delarude Sandstorm. Carl's got some uh, hectic height going on with his car. Just beamer things. Let's see how he goes. <laughs> so it looks like we've got a different layout for tonight where the guys have thrown in some uh, cones for the guys to do donuts around as well. That's great. <laughs> See how Kyle goes. Nice. Little flick. Yes. Woo. There we go. Beamer. Oh. A nice 180. 31 wagon. MX5. Really nice Ford or 34. I want to know what this guy's put in this thing. What actually got you into Beamers to start with? Yeah, they're cheap. <laughs> and I was a BMW technician. <laughs> I'm in the full red right now. Where are we looking? In here. Yep. I mean, we're at 103 degrees. 103? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> What's happening with the 32? Uh, what do you think's happening with the 32? I saw your Facebook story and I immediately got worried because I thought something had happened. And then I saw Andrew being pulled out and I was like, what happened? Go Cal, go, come on. Yes. Which I thought you just had a turbo issue last time. Oh. I saw um, I did. I replaced the turbo with a 34 turbo. Turns out the guy that sold it to me, I think it might have been a dead turbo to begin with. Turbo seals were already gone. It was peeing out oil. Uh, so I flagged and pulled the motor. That, that was a good run, man. Can you do it again for me? Uh, I was sorry. I was not watching at the time. We're gonna have a rave party going on out here in the guy in the van. Is it stock? That? Yeah, yeah. What? Yeah. what? He just locked the diff, I'm assuming? I don't even know if it's got that done. He rolled it the other way. Oh, oh really? Here. Yeah, he flipped it here. <laughs> but on the other side, you'll see all the, like, where it's creased and everything. But yeah, it tipped over. You can put it back up, put tires on it. <laughs> don't even need it like a Japanese or an ADM car these days. It's <laughs> awesome. Hold track. I love that van.
learn there's something really cool? I think it's really cool. Do you guys remember my old 350Z? It was silver. It's here tonight. The new owner has bought it uh, and has continued drifting it, which is sick. Check it out. Still looking pretty. <laughs> Look at this van! I love this thing! It's insane! I'll try and catch up with the owner in the pits later on tonight, but he's told me it's completely stock, and all he has done... <laughs> all he has done is weld the diff. So we've had Mr. Van all night. <laughs> he's been playing Darude Sandstorm, Techno, uh, no, blow my whistle. Uh, every 90s techno, tiesto, skip mix song you could ever think of has been playing and blasting out of this thing tonight. So it's been a lot of fun for us as, <laughs> as crew and staff and stuff as well. Chosen, go! So everyone out here is a beginner. Some guys pick it up faster than other guys. And for others, you kind of just need to be thrown in the deep end. It's really cool to see all the different varieties of people that come out. Some people have like an innate talent for it. They can just pick it up like that. And other people, it might take them a couple of weeks to get the hang of it. Or to get the muscle memory down. Or to figure out what to do with their hands and their feet. Or to get the timing right. Uh, or, you know, to even set their car up right. Like, there's so many different factors to drifting. Hello, Zetu! How are you guys finding it? What do you reckon? This is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be a troublemaker here. I'm gonna ask Jack if he wants to tandem with the van. What do you guys reckon? Yep. Awesome. Alright, so you're gonna lead Chase with the 350Z and the van. We're gonna give it a go. Alright, so you're, you said you wanna lead? Yeah, I'm ready to go. I'm in first. Alright. Chase! Lead! Go yeah. for it. <laughs> this is <gonna> great. <laughs> We got the van versus the 350. They're going together. I asked them if they're happy to tan them. They both said yes. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> this is so great. <laughs> Great night. You guys can drift anything. Please bring everything and anything to Archie. We got a moichiro kurasai. We have a one more time. The van would like to chase Jack. Yeah, I was gonna say this is a big first view on all mods. How's it tandeming with a van? <laughs> Where do you upload those? Loki SX. This thing's pretty rad. He's been throwing it around all night. It actually drifts pretty well. We got a cool 31 wagon. This thing looks too pretty. It sounds really cool too. It drifts effortlessly. Nice 
some more 31s out tonight. Oh, yeah. Joyride with Jack. Yeah. Alright, so what, what's this briefing? I need to put my feet up on here somewhere. Yep, feet up on that like weird coloured speck. Oh, yeah, on the white stuff? Yeah, otherwise you'll burn your shoes. <laughs> Alright, right. uh, there is no carpet, there's no sound deadening, there's nothing in this, it's just chassis. So I'll get my helmet on and uh, we'll go from there. Man, it's like getting into a sauna. Yo, no wonder you're getting out sweating. Been here 20 times. Damn, really? There's some motivation for you guys. Coming out, we're not sure if we're on fire or not. It just looks like it because the car's light shining through. <laughs> All right, sweet. Okay, so we're not on fire. Excellent. <laughs> 